What is the difference between a lazy eye and a squint? Watch this video to learn about the key differences between the two very different conditions. First, we will focus on what a squint is. A squint is also known as a strabismus. A strabismus essentially means that one or both of the eyes, typically one of the eyes, is misaligned. The eye can either be pointing up, down, in or out. And essentially, if this occurs, it means that both of the eyes, instead of working together, are working independently. This can typically result in double vision. However, this is not always the case because if this condition develops early in life, patients can adapt to this and they essentially block the image of one eye so that double vision does not occur. Depending on the cause of the squint, the management and treatment will also vary. For example, there are certain types of squint that are associated with certain types of problems such as long-sightedness. If you want to learn more about long-sightedness then definitely watch the other video in this short series where I describe what short-sightedness and long-sightedness both are. So for example if one has a prescription that is long-sighted there are certain types of squint when if one is given the correct spectacle correction the squint will align and correct itself and therefore the eye will point straight ahead. There are also other types of squint whereby this is not the case and in order to correct these as typically a surgical intervention and approach is required. I will now go on to describe what an amblyopic or a lazy eye is. It is important to remember that an amblyopic eye is not a squint or a turn in the eye or eyes which people frequently confuse it for. An amblyopic eye essentially looks like a completely normal eye and structurally it is a normal eye. However, abnormal visual development has taken place and therefore the amblyopic eye or the lazy eye does not see as well as the other eye or the good eye. Typically this condition can occur as part of a squint but it can also occur for other reasons. The treatment for amblyopia, particularly if caught and detected early, usually in childhood, involves a treatment program which includes patching. Patching can take many shapes and forms, however, in a nutshell, it classically involves blocking out the good eye that has developed properly and normally and forcing the brain to use the images coming from the bad eye or the amblyopic eye in order to drive visual processing and therefore drive visual development. So remember, a squint or a turn in the eye is not the same as an amblyopic or lazy eye. The latter is when one does not see very well whereas a squint or turn simply means that the eye is not looking straight ahead. Thank you for watching this current video in my series of what is dot dot dot. If you have found this video useful then please do give it a like and consider subscribing to my channel. If you have any suggestions for future topics that I could cover as part of this short series format then please do comment below or get in touch with myself and inform me as to what you would like me to potentially do. Thank you so much for your time and take care.